G'day YouTube, Four Nines Fine Silver here. G'day guys. Today I am continuing on the same path as I was on yesterday, trying to do this spiky dinosaur, little tail. And uh, while I'm at you, I might as well show you those couple of extra pieces that you probably haven't seen before. I've got the, the new cheetah, who's come up pretty good. Sorry I didn't do the filming on that one. And the same with this, uh, this bull, who's come up good. Nice and solid legs and tail. He's... He's a, he's a good one. Anyway, guys, today I've got the same mould. I did it the same way, but only this time. I just didn't go quite as deep when I pushed down his feet so the side of it could just touch those edges there so I could get it out again. Now, it's fallen out fairly well. Let's give it a pour and see how we go. Um, wait on. I've just forgotten something. Alrighty, well here's the pewter, my torch, and I might just set this up a little better so you can actually see, so I'll go back a bit, and that's about the middle, alright we've got our pewter pot, torch, oh, there you go. Side. Well, hopefully it's worked a little bit better today. Now, while we're waiting for that to set, if you wouldn't mind going over and hitting that uh, thumbs up button. If you're not subscribed, then hit the uh, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell. Now, don't forget if you do hit the notification bell to uh, go up to all so you get everything that I do there's no point in missing out on anything I want to thank you all for coming over here today and checking out my videos and uh, that's still taking a bit of time so I must have heated it a little bit warm but that's okay it shouldn't be far away now it's getting much closer all right, what I might do is see if I can pull out that the sprue early. Oop, I'll let it dry now and we are to see it drying. Just makes it a little bit easier for me to get it out of the mould now that it's there. So let's put that aside. It's still going to be very hot. All right, let's pull it apart. Oh, we'll have a look. it off all right let's see how we turned out well, you've got a bit of overhang just there but all the rest of them looks pretty good 
Let's just give him a rub over with the brush. Let's turn this around so you can see it. Alright, eh? move a bit of stuff so we don't cause any dramas. Better put the power on. Alright, eh? hold your ears. He's pretty good, apart from this little over bit, which what happened is the, the moulds come away and it's been able to leak. So what I'll do is I'll get my, my nippers out. See, I don't mind this sort of, this sort of thing because this is fairly easy to fix. So all you do then is you go along with your nippers and just cut it away. You can see everything about the the piece where you've got a cut. Try not to cut his toes off, of course. And then you can just nibble away at it. And at the same time, these pieces are really easy to save. And just trim down around his foot, around his leg. Sometimes getting your scissors in the right position is sometimes a bit difficult. Just keep an eye on what you're doing. From underside is normally the best. There you go. What's that one? That's starting to look pretty good. A couple of little bits and pieces. All right, I'll give it another brush. Let's take out the sprue. Okay, that comes out. Get it nice and close. Alright. What I do then, I'll get my Dremel. Which has got this little blade on the end of it. And then I'll just trim around that foot that was damaged. And there you have him, more or less finished. You can keep going over it with your Dremel, give it a scrub over. I'm going to take that out a bit further. But all in all, pretty pleased. Put him over here with these ones. Move some of that stuff out of the way. I'll turn the camera over. Don't forget, guys. Oh, I'll move that as well. If you, oh, what do I do? I 
I don't know what I did then, but we're back. All right, if you want to get on my sticker board, please, there's a, uh, an email address, there's a, uh, a postal address, and uh, send me something. I'm happy to open it on camera. I'll give you a shout out. And uh, anyone who wants to donate to the channel, there's a uh, Pal Pay Me thing in there as well. Uh, what do you call it? A link. And any monies raised will go straight back into tools and other essentials. Alright guys, I'll give you another look at these new pieces. Anyone who's interested in purchasing, please email me. And uh, we'll see what we can come up with. Righto guys, I'll catch you on the next one. So that's it from me, so don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.